Okay, here we go. What's the third thing you did when you woke up this morning? Hit the snooze button for the third time. What's the first role you ever auditioned for? Anakin Skywalker in The Phantom Menace. What's something new you learned in the past week? I learned how to make a coconut soup. Window or aisle? Window. Bagel or croissant? Croissant. I'm embarrassed about it. Beatles or Stones? Stones. No, Beatle, I'm not answering that question. Person living or dead you'd like to grab a drink with? The Dalai Lama, I'd love to see what that guy would drink. And what would you drink? If I was with the Dalai Lama, probably water. What is a hidden talent of yours? I can fire dance. Does this <laughs> with fire. It's like a Polynesian uh, dance. What's one thing you couldn't live without? Rick Hoffman. What's one thing you really could live without? Rick Hoffman. <laughs> Complete this sentence. If you weren't an actor, you would be? Rick Hoffman. <laughs> Sorry. What day in your life would you love to relive? The day I proposed to my fiance. If you could visit any period in history, what would you choose? 1985. And on a scale of 1 to 10, how well would you fit in? I feel like I could make it work. In your opinion, what is the sexiest accent? Scottish. What is the funniest sounding non-funny word? Kumquat. How long could you last without your phone? I could last the rest of my life without my phone. It would be just fine. What's the strangest gift you've ever received? My mom gave me one of those ab crunchers for Christmas one year. <laughs> Did you keep it? I tried to ab crunch a little bit. It didn't work. Best advice you ever received? Just be yourself. You don't have to impress anybody. Do you follow it? Still trying. If you could give your teenage self advice, what would that be? Take it easy on yourself. If he could see you now, what would your teenage self be most impressed by? Um, I think... He would be impressed that he's uh, that he's doesn't he's not as scared, uh, and that he's uh, that people trust him to to do the work that he does, and that he can make a coconut soup. <laughs> What's a children's book that you can't wait to share with your kids? Oh, the places you go by Dr. Seuss. If your life was a children's book, what would the title be? Go the f to sleep. What's that one? <laughs> it's a book. It's a real book. What is your favorite thing that you get to do or say on Suits? I really love memorizing huge chunks of dialogue. It's a great challenge. And your favorite scene on Suits that you were not in? Well, getting frisky with Scotty in the airplane. <laughs> Hello. You ultimately mean, what would I be embarrassed by if I'm listening to it and Patrick over here hears me listening to it, right? A song by Neil Sedaka called Bad Blood. Bad, bad, blood, blood, you didn't, didn't.